Now one may be wondering what could the occasion possibly be to warrant me stepping out the way I did today and I would tell you respectfully a funeral. Shame, shame, shame on me for having the audacity to have fun and watch a damn anime. Demon Slayer put me in check real fast. I thought Mugen Train was all sunshine and rainbows, you know? Demon Slayer a cool little junt, nothing bad gonna happen. <laughs> Akaza had other plans. Bro showed up drip as hell and that nigga on the ox definitely knew what was going on. Bro did a mean ass rip. Akaza came here with one goal in mind. Main character, kill his ass. And Goku jumped in like, nah, nigga, nah, nigga. Now, I'm honestly at the edge of my seat at this point. Bro regenerated faster than the post nut clarity kicked in, letting us know we have a very hostile, special grade upper three on our hands. He was the exact opposite of hostile. He was zesty as hell over, and Goku kept it short and blunt. I just met you? I don't think I've hated a nigga more in my life. I guess I had the damn audacity to show up and try to recruit this man. Like, bro, you've gone mad. You know damn well he ain't finna agree to that. Bro laid out his offer hella nice, though. I gotta be honest. You're a Hashira, but you're also human. Humans are weak. They get tired. You might be young and explosive, but unfattest is slowly approaching. Come join the young nigga. Yodro had the floor, and the best thing he could come up with was growing old. Dying, stinking, injuries. Baby, that's what make this life bumping, nigga. We lit. Akaza didn't need to hear nothing more. They left. Put your hands up. Ran down on them. First, take a look at the form. This is some of the most etiquette running form I've ever seen. Forget the neutral. Let me see what your hands like, nigga. On Pancho, so damn bottom barrel at this point in the series, he can't even comprehend what's happening. It looked like Naruto and Sasuke fight. Akaza was full of surprises, though. He out here zoning using Sekizo. Like, how the hell do you even get an ability like this? We need the good set and incredible reaction speed like the niggas complimenting himself mid fight that's just disrespectful they having an elite expression of taijutsu though i can't lie bro jumped over that nice ass slide switch and goku ducked the right hand mashed on akaza mid combo <laughs> Bro ass off the stage onto a new one. Akaza popped up like a Chica jump scare finna get it in blood right back. You really notice how good these Demon Slayer fights are when you slow them down like this. I'm not even finna glaze. It's peak though. When you slow it down, you see these niggas are really in their Bellator bag. With the right hand, duck the left one. Kyodro ran around the damn tree. Rewind that one more time. Them niggas ain't paying attention. Ran around the damn tree. Bent the block. Punished the young man for that reckless left hand. The flimsy left hand wasn't alone though because same day delivery. Oh, big head kick. Joe Rogan somewhere losing his damn mind. Imagine you're Aaron Yeager in Tampico. You see bro run in the forest and fly right Right back out. Like, forgive me for my insolence, but when did you grow wings? Akasa deadass kept trying to recruit this man like no means no, bro already said he don't like you. Got slashed and said sensational Tanjiranimo looking like, I don't know you mean sensational. We talking backflip, reset the neutral side, step the right hand just by an inch. Still drew blood, rushed in a mean ass side. Switch. Look, if you ain't make this face when you seen this, then you just wasn't watching the show the right way. Then peep that Akasa is no longer in his animation. His eyes are literally on Rengoku the entire damn time. That's how huge this power gap was. The nigga didn't do one move bro wasn't wary of. Lost his arms, grew him back, kept what doing strings like, stop playing with this man name. You why oh, Goku 5H, oh, oh, oh. if you know, you know. <laughs> Sim hoes are times two damage on all Hashira. Comes with a guaranteed critical hit and a saliva cough up from your victim. Bro busts out this big ass tiger and all it took was an arm? He finna grow it back, ain't he? <laughs> this some damn bull. Then Rin Goku get in flame. Akaza like off the arm slash on the body. I can't lie, I feel great right now. What about you though? Damn it! It should have ate that on a giddy the man gave me out of his pocket. Left eye swole, broken ribs, organs. Like the 69 guy got a hold of you. Aren't you tired of getting your ass whooped? One more UI 5 base, and they gon' need to recast. That's your heart ablaze, nigga! Don't you wanna live forever? Set your heart 
a blaze! I'm not gonna lie, bro. This fight was so damn fire, and I'm dying inside at this point because Rengoku hasn't done an ounce of real damage. I'm thinking Akaza concerned on some, oh, he might kill me. Bro ass is glazing his aura, chat. Glazing his damn aura. He really don't give a damn about nothing bro is doing. Look at this amazing ass anime, bro. I see, listening to these toxic ass communities, they have you thinking this show some ass. Bro did a full ass level three aim for the head, unlike Toji. Akaza smacked the sword away from his neck. Hell no. He smacked the sword away from his neck. He was in tune with everything Rengoku was doing the entire damn fight. He smacked the sword away from his neck while maintaining the smile on his face. Turn Rengoku into Rengoku. Whatever you do, don't let Kakashi see this. The nigga might crash out. The damn sun started coming up. Akaza like, hell no. Nah. Hey, y'all have fun. Catch me at the castle, nigga. It really be like that, though. The summer has not been kind. This is how niggas in Arizona be. Hajiro threw his sword. Ford gave his ass an intense lecture over some soft ass music. They showing Rengoku backstory earlier too. Like this nigga gonna die, ain't he? Let's go.